Look at me there now. Oh, look at me now. Ah, there we go. I'm getting paper. Look at me now. Oh, <laughs> look at me now. What? Fresh than a motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> no, yours. I think I still think that they say you got no sound over there. Uh, it's just kind of a, a bit slow. I think. You're I'm sure? gonna check for a second. I- so I'm gonna listen right now. Um, yes, yeah, see, I hear you. I hear me too. Oh yeah. All right, we good. It just had to catch up. Now I need to fix whatever's oh, going look at on. They, 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 Twenty-five people are still waiting. Oh. Yay. All right. Okay. Sorry. Ron Bryant said, oh, the sound is perfect. We can start smoking again. So, Courtney Michelle. There we go. Courtney, whatever I have done. In my fact, no. Hey, I pull know the I camera done. back. That's you. That's why I can't fix it. I told you. You said put my camera back? Yeah, the, the in the stream yard. Pull it. Oh. You got me all up in here. And I'm like, why can't I? Thank you. Jesus. Pete in heaven. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. He said, why the hell can't I change it? <laughs> no, JP. Um, Hey, Move It Twerks. Hey, Move It Twerks. We low-key restreaming this to her um, channel, Move It Twerks. JP the inspiring matriarch. You might want to go over there. That's what the chat really is. So um Thank you for that, cousin. I appreciate it. Of course. And I'll put a link to JP's channel in the chat. Uh in my chat. But listen, so Courtney Michelle, I apologize about surviving Lapeef, right? At the end of the day, it was like I was highly upset about you going back to JR and telling JR everything that Lucky had told you, a lot of which I had trusted um I had trusted her to not tell anybody. But I forgive you, um I forgive you, Courtney, for the things and the actions that you have taken behind you know your hurt about what I did. I, I forgive you. I'm I gen I'm genuinely over it. I believe that um JP, brother Rico, um Bolo I think that the praying and um, the spirits has finally reached me, right? Where, like I told JP, uh, six months, the only thing you're going to see on here is reactions and and, li- and live videos about me coding, right? By the end of the year, I want this channel to have enough um, videos about coding that people can literally come here and learn, right? Come here and actually pick up something, take it, make money. Um. I'm talking about binary options. Lucky taught me about binary options. You see how easy it is to be honest, guys. Lucky taught me a way that I can make, you know, $100, $200 a day legally. And I love her for that. And I'll never forget that. Um, I was already into real estate because my father owned homes. My father taught me about, um, it's, it's, so everybody know that real estate is specific to where you live at. And um, in Detroit, we have something here called the Detroit Land Bank. And my father bought multiple homes from the Detroit Land Bank, fixed them up, um, got them approved by the city within six months. And, um, at, you know, after that, everything is cool. I know about property taxes. I know about buying lots of land. Um, I have my LLC right long industries llc I, it's literally it's literally beneath me right now if anybody want to see it i'll be more than willing to you know just put it right on the screen but um i got it through legal zoom and so there's a lot of different stuff that i was working on in my life at the time jp knows this because like i had my studio going too my studio was absolutely beautiful you know and now i was in the process of being rebuilt yeah, Vanna, I'm from Detroit, Brightmore, honey years. Honey years, Vanna. Um, shout out to everybody out there in Brightmore. Shout out to everybody in West Side Detroit, East Side Detroit, man. You know, I love my East Side family. Shout out to all the seven mile bloods, you know what I'm saying? S and B. Um, for me. I'm like JP, how many times have I said it now? Like I I'm really over this whole situation. As much as I love Lucky and JP, you know I love that girl a lot. It's just not its not fruitful for us to be in each other's lives. I don't think that she feels like she's, it's like, 
at the end of it, I'm pretty sure she feels like she walked away with nothing. Right? And I respect that she feels that way. At the same time, I feel like I walked away with nothing because, um, you know, there was opportunity for us to grow. So let me address Lucky now. Whatever I did to make you not trust me enough to tell my information to other people, I apologize and I forgive you. And, um, this, you know, even after we fell out, even after we weren't cool, Anton went at you. I do want to speak about that. Let me sit up because now I'm actually focused. <laughs> <laughs> when Anton spoke about you at the town hall meeting, I defended you on Brother Clarence show specifically. I even went off on Brother Clarence. Brother Clarence ended up apologizing to me. He understood where I was coming because, you know, I kept telling you all throughout the year, like, them people don't really fuck with you. Anton don't really fuck with you. Right? That's why he went on po pocket watching with JT and he tried to say that you weren't credible. When I know for a fact that you know how to make money. I know for a fact that you take care of your children. I know for a fact that you're a good mother. I know for a fact that you are not a woman of low character. You are not, um, you know, some whore or some fun girl or the type of person that would entertain two guys at once. I do not believe that, you know, these rumors that, you know, not even rumors because, you know, I know you told me that you told Chicago Rilla, he told E Black, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But there was nothing between you and King. The, the situation with King is the fact that he's jealous. And, and and I hope that, you know, God put within his heart that he can be better, that he can that he can talk to women without bringing up other men. There is space for him to grow. And King, it is in the realm of possibility that you can talk to women without bringing my name up. I know this for a fact. And it didn't get you anywhere. You're not with Lucky. She's not opening her legs for you. She damn near didn't. She, she didn't open her heart for you. You didn't get nothing out of that. Except your panel destroyed and your fucking plant, your whole fucking platform destroyed. And me, I was the key to your fucking shit, if you're being honest. But I forgive you, my brother. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm over that whole situation now, man. I'm on a bigger and better things. You know what I'm 